Hey everyone, uh, today I'm going to show you how to make a fisheye effect for non-warped videos. So, here I have a video of my friend Nathan skating, doing a kickflip on an extremely difficult floor stair. Um, each stair is elongated, um, so it's really hard to do anything off it because there's not really enough height, um, you know, to have time to do your trick. I don't know, maybe you don't skate, maybe you don't know what I'm talking about. Um, but anyway, we are going to go to effects and presets and select warp, drag it over, change the warp style to fisheye, and it should work at first, but for this footage it will not because you can kind of tell I manually, or digitally rather, warped it up on these trees right here. The warp style seems to be changing on them, so what we can do is either increase or decrease the bend amount. If I put it at say 13, it won't affect those trees as much, but it's barely gonna look like a fisheye. So let's bring it back up to like, you know, 60 or so. And that's gonna look pretty bad. So what we can do is increase the horizontal and vertical distortion, and then scale our footage up. And that corrects the problem pretty well and we're left with a pretty nice looking fisheye. Let's see Nathan pop this sweet kickflip. Wait. Gotta let it render. That looks pretty cool. Uh, so I shot this on a DSLR and it was in 1080p but it just it didn't look good to me because you know skate videos need to you know they need to have that characteristic fisheye. Um, that's beside the point. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching this video. Subscribe. I have tons of other special effects tutorials, a lot of them in After Effects. Eh, probably most of them in After Effects. But anyway, um, I will see you later. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.